Android is known for its flexibility when it comes to personalization. Customizing your mobile allows you to make it truly yours. You can change internal applications, wallpapers, themes, icons and fonts to match your style and preferences. The assistant menu is a customizable on-screen menu that provides a quick access to common controls and gestures such as navigation buttons, swiping and on-screen touchpad. To turn on assistant menu, follow these simple steps. Tap to open the settings application, tap on accessibility, tap on interaction and dexterity, then tap on assistant menu to toggle on. You'll then be able to use and customize the assistant menu including navigation bar. The navigation bar height and position settings control the size and location of the navigation bar on the screen. On this section, you can find and browse custom icons to represent the navigation buttons of your navigation bar. You are not limited to default icon sets, giving you freedom to select icons that resonate with your personal style or preferences. Configure the actions you want for each navigation button. Back home recents. You may be able to assign actions such as launching apps, opening browsers, or performing system functions. After configuring the long pressing actions, the changes will apply within the customization app. Try to long press the navigation buttons to see if the assigned actions work as expected. As you dive into your creative journey, you'll come across a vibrant color palette tool that's akin to an artist's palette. This powerful feature empowers you to handpick and craft the perfect colors for your navigation bar buttons, allowing you to sculpt both the backdrop hue and the text vivid shade with precision and artistic finesse. The navigation bar auto hide setting is a useful way to save space on the screen. When the navigation bar is set to auto hide, it will only be displayed when you need it. You can customize the auto hide setting to change the number of seconds before the navigation bar automatically hides. Swipe up sensitivity setting controls how sensitive the navigation bear is to swipe gestures. The higher the sensitivity, the less you need to swipe up to activate the navigation bar. The default sensitivity is medium, however you can change it to low or high. Imagine having complete control over your device's control center. Most people believe that altering its appearance is complex, but we're here to change that perception. This app takes customization to the next level. Not only can you change the shape of notification icons to match your style, but you can also choose new colors for your existing icons. Wave goodbye to the standard look and embrace customization that reflects your personality and preferences. And if you are feeling extra fancy, Color Wheel gives you the power to create custom palettes. Mix and match until you've crafted the perfect color scheme that complements your style to empower you with greater control over your status bar. The app will request specific permissions. These permissions serve as the access keys to unlock a world of customization possibilities. Once you've granted these permissions, you'll have the ability to tailor your status bar to better suit your preferences. Often overlooked, the status bar is that narrow strip at the top of your device's screen, despite its unassuming appearance. Once you've granted these permissions, you'll have the ability to tailor your status bar to better suit your preferences. Now with these permissions in hand, you can make your status bar work for you. Beyond that, you can replace the default icons in your status bar with ones that reflect your personality or match your sense of style. It plays a crucial role in providing you with real-time information of your device activities, showing you notifications, indicating network connections, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, displaying the remaining battery and telling you the time. This is a free app that allows you to add both static and animated backgrounds to your Android phone. It has a wide variety of wallpapers to choose from, including abstract patterns, nature scenes and cityscapes. On the main screen of the app, you will see a collection of wallpapers. Browse through the wallpapers and when you find a wallpaper you like, tap on it to preview it. You can also customize the wallpapers by adjusting the particle size, speed and density. To set the wallpaper, tap on the set wallpaper button. In the set wallpaper dialog, select the home screen option or both. Navigate to your device's settings. Within the settings menu, scroll down or search for the apps option. This option is usually labeled as apps or applications. Tap on the app you want to assign to be your launcher. This app will perform the action of displaying apps on home screen whenever you press the home button. Setting launcher or any other custom launcher as your default home screen. App is a straightforward process that can significantly enhance your Android experience. With the ability to customize your home screen and access various features, you can make your smartphone bloom. 
Enjoy exploring the endless possibilities of other handy features, customizing your lock screen wallpaper and enabling fingerprint lock using a fingerprint lock screen app can enhance the security and personalization of your Android device. You can set a lock screen wallpaper that suits your style and enjoy the convenience and security of unlocking your device with your fingerprint. Go to settings and tap on developer options. Scroll down and find the minimum width option. Tap on it and enter a preferred number in the text field. This can be especially important for apps that are running on older devices or devices with limited resources accessible to users with smaller devices. Tap on OK. This means that apps, fonts and widgets will not be able to be resized to be smaller than 500 pixels wide. It can also make the apps more visually appealing on larger devices. Having a consistent user experience regardless of the screen size is important. Reducing the minimal width of an app can also improve its performance. This is because it reduces the amount of code and data that needs to be loaded, which can free up resources for other tasks, such as smartphones. This is because it allows users to resize the app to fit on their screen.